Okay, Rigsby, listen. I understand how you're feeling right now. Believe me. But you are a father and you have children you need to see grow up. Besides, I think she's still alive. You do? Yes. Abak's revenge plan was disrupted by Grace when she broke his phone hack, so... He realized then that it was only a matter of time before we tracked him down. This is him making the best of the situation. Then why did he come here? To gloat, watch us squirm. And he plans to make us let him go when he's done. We won't let him get away with it. Answer me. Where is she? Rigsby. Where's my wife? Whoa, Rigsby, calm down. Calm down. Just count to ten. Just count to ten. Where's my Count to ten. Wife. No, we don't want to kill him. We just want to make him talk. I have a plan. This isn't about one of your plans. So you need to stop and just talk to me, okay? Talk to me, Rigsby. There's another way. I'm going to make him talk. No, Rigsby. No, no, Rigsby, you don't want to do this. Oh. I got no time to play games here. I want answers. Answer me. Where's my wife? Last chance. Okay, you need to let me handle this. No, there's no time. I have to find Grace. You're going to set fire to the only person that can tell us where she is. What is the point of that? What is that going to prove? Drop something? Drop the flare. Don't. Get rid of the flare. Okay, okay. Give me your coat. Put the vest in the trunk. You, Jane, you're going to drive. Let's go. Easy. Man was curious about his wife. I'm going to satisfy that curiosity. Get in. Back up, disarm the sister, and stop Tybok. Nice work, Wayne. He said he was gonna save me, and he did. You do realize you got shot with your own gun? Oh, please, Joe, no jokes. It hurts when I laugh. No, I'm just saying, if you tell that story in the future, you might want to leave that part out. Seriously, I'm gonna split a stitch. Just... <laughs> you go. Let you get some rest. I don't know what we would have done if we lost you. I knew you guys would come. Bye. <laughs> You two take very good care of each other. Oh, didn't mean to interrupt. Oh, we were uh, just leaving. I wanted to come by and see how you're doing. Thank you. And to let you know that you impressed the hell out of us. Not too many people can do what you did. Thank you. Really. I'm just glad that you're both okay. Yeah. Yeah. And if you two ever think about getting back to our side of the business, give me a call. I don't think so. No. Civilian life, here we come. No, that's too bad. Anyhow, office still open. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna head out too. Don't go yet, buddy. Lunch coming up. Get your own hospital lunch. It's really not that bad. I got cherry cobbler. I'm really angry at you for doing what you did, but then I thought better of it. It was a stupid idea, but hey, it worked. Well, stupid, not necessarily stupid, simple. Not stupid. But I am still angry at you for not telling me what you were going to do. I thought you'd gone nuts. Oh, come on, please. It's not like I haven't abducted people before. It's not funny. I was really scared. I'm sorry. No, you're not. I can tell when you're not being sincere now. Look, clearly you can't because I am sorry. 